you, I see your blessing truly come to right. you. I'll own a journey to a cure. Deep in Delhi, that's for sure. Deli, Everything will be alright. So I said it will be okay. Now we have a sign of mind because we took a leap of faith. Right. Who thought would come the day that I would stop having this pain? Feeling depressed and deranged. Suffering, not through our pain. But here's a miracle. Clearing all the obstacles. Being TAU, I see your Brothers Julius and Desmond Means were just babies when they were diagnosed with sickle cell disease, an inherited blood disorder that can cause extreme pain, organ damage, stroke, and other complications. I was just totally prepared to live out my whole life with sickle cell. As many as 100,000 people in the United States are affected by sickle cell. The disease causes red blood cells, shaped like a sickle or crescent, to become hard and sticky. These abnormal cells deliver less oxygen to the body's tissues. Growing up, Julius and Desmond tired easily and couldn't play or keep up with their friends. As they grew older, the disease caused bone damage and affected Julius's lungs. Sickle cell was damaging Desmond's organs. Like when I go to school, people would be like, oh, what's wrong with his eyes? You know, your eyes are, are green or it's yellow. Like, what's, what's wrong with that? I'm like, well, I got something called sickle cell disease. But the brothers no longer suffer from sickle cell. Julius and Desmond both received successful stem cell transplants at the University of Illinois Hospital to cure their sickle cell disease. The transplants were performed using a relatively new treatment approach without the toxic effects of chemotherapy. The transplants were made possible by their healthy brother, Clifford, who was a rare match for his two younger brothers. They're cured of sickle cell now because of Clifford. So I have a miracle going on in my family. Clifford was given medication to increase the number of stem cells in his bloodstream. Then his blood was processed through a machine that collects white cells, including stem cells. The stem cells were then frozen until the transplants were performed. Instead of wiping out a patient's bone marrow with chemotherapy, physicians at the University of Illinois Hospital and Health Sciences System used medication to suppress the body's immune system and gave one small dose of radiation right before the transplant. The procedure is relatively uncommon in the United States, and UI Hospital is the first to offer the treatment in the Chicago area. We, we were all elated. I mean, I had won the lottery of health. I, mean, I had been praying for this all of their lives. It's been several months since their transplants, and Julius and Desmond have goals and dreams for their future. While hospitalized, Julius composed a rap about receiving his bone marrow transplant at UI Hospital. But here's a miracle, clearing all my obstacles. BMT at UI see your dreams in our reality. UI Health has a comprehensive sickle cell center dedicated to adult and pediatric research and patient care. This is Sherry McGinnis Gonzalez reporting for UIC News. <laughs> you know, so. <laughs>